Season opener for USF, third meeting all time between the Bulls and the Rattlers of Florida A&M. A second start for sophomore quarterback Quentin Flowers. Now this was a low scoring game at first and then it got out of hand in USF's favor. No scoring until two minutes left in the first. 22 yard field goal by Emilio Nadelman. The Bulls would pour it on in the second. Tremendous scramble by Flowers to keep the play alive on a drive that would lead to a touchdown. Sean Price with the reception. And now Flowers again showcasing his running ability and why he won the starting quarterback job. Escapes the tackle, somehow finds a streaking to Ernest Johnson in the back of the end zone, motions him towards the opposite corner, and there he is wide open. The first touchdown of the Bulls season, USF on top. They would miss the extra point though, 9 to nothing at that point. And now the Bulls are going to run the two-minute drill before the first half comes to an end. Tremendous look down the near sideline. 45-yard touchdown from Flowers to Ernest Johnson once again. 16 to nothing at the half. Bulls on top. Flowers 141 yards and two touchdowns in that first half. And then immediately in the third quarter, the quarterback's going to do it on the ground this time. 29-yard touchdown run. It was 23 to nothing at this point. The Bulls finished with 281 yards on the ground. Flowers pulled for Stephen Bench, giving him a little rest with the game well in hand. And Stephen Bench making the Florida A&M defense pay 62-yard touchdown pass to the freshman tight end Elkana Dillon, who finished with 126 yards on the game. The Bulls improved to 18-1 in home openers in a 51-3 route over Florida A&M.